Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. As you can tell by the title, um, we're getting into my oral hygiene routine. This is before I actually started dental hygiene school. So let's just get right into the video. Like sometimes I'll either rinse my mouth out first with mouthwash or I won't. I'll just jump right into flossing. This is the mouthwash that I use. This, I'm telling you, this mouthwash will keep your breath. I think I've seen this on YouTube and ever since I've been hooked. But all you need is just a little bit of this. And don't, all the other ones, they don't taste as good, but I just get the pink one. So if you're going to try it out, just make sure you get the pink one. And then I just... And then I spit that out. I do it for like 30 seconds to a minute. And then... I grab my floss um this is the kind that i like to use uh it's the glide oral b pro health um so i just get like a, a little bit of this and i'm gonna be honest just recently i actually just learned how to uh really floss my teeth the correct way because I wasn't doing it. I was flossing, but I wasn't doing it correctly. So the correct way is to do, like, get the floss like this and then go up and around both sides of the tooth. So um, I'm going to do that. And then I'm going to just let y'all watch. Um, so I do floss before I brush. As you can see, I'm doing, like, the C motion like this. Make sure I'm getting like both surfaces of the tooth. And then I do the bottom. The same way. finger placement and all that stuff is probably all the way wrong but whatever I flossed them and I tried to do it the correct way but whatever so now I just get my toothbrush and I just recently started using the burst toothbrush um this is what the packaging looks like um and I really got this one because it says it's supposed to have like a one month uh battery life and it really does last a whole month um, with just like one charge overnight. And it has three modes. It has white and sensitive and then massage. In this clip, I was trying to mention that the toothbrush head itself does have charcoal bristles in it. For some reason, I couldn't get this out, but that's what I meant. And that's what I wanted to mention. Now, back to the video. I usually just use the second mode, which is sensitive. Uh, when I first got it, I tried the massage mode, and it was it was heavenly. Like, I never felt nothing like that before. I haven't tried the white one, but I, I've heard that it's a little bit more aggressive than the sensitive one. But I just usually stick in the middle and use that middle one. Um, another thing I like about this is um, it does have like 30 second quadrant so it'll go 30 seconds here and then it'll stop and that'll tell you you know it's time to go to the the second quadrant so it'll do 30 30 30 30 and in the middle of the 30 second quadrants it'll like completely stop and i actually like that because it lets you know like you should be done with this quadrant of your mouth and going to the next one um the only thing i really don't like about it is like once you use it, like, as you can tell, like, the toothpaste is, like, around the smiley part, and that's kind of, like, eh. But that's really the only complaint that I have, and I really don't know, like, how I could clean this out, but 
whatever besides the point i just got the black one it comes in like rose gold lavender white and black and i got the black one because it's just nice and sleek looking um but yeah overall i would give this burst toothbrush a 10 out of 10. now i usually just wet the toothbrush with some water and then i'm gonna be using this toothpaste um i usually go between like colgate and crest um i've tried a, a few other ones too like i i know i like the um gum detoxify we use this too um so we just really go between like two or three different kinds but we really just be sticking to the same few so another thing i like about the burst toothbrush is that it is it's not loud um it's not as loud as the one i had before and the one i had before was um the oral b 1000 electric toothbrush to turn it on all you do is just press the smiley face and then it'll remember like which one you used last so this one will come on because that's the one I, I I use less and that's the one I usually do use so I'm gonna press it and then let y'all see so as you can see it turned on now I'm just gonna brush my teeth wipe my mouth off to get like the excess toothpaste off and then um like i'll spit or whatever and then right after i actually brush i'll use my um tongue scraper i got this from walmart for like um five bucks or something but it's time really time for a new one but this is what it looks like and it's super easy to use so what I do is I'll run this under some water and then I'll scrape like and then I'll rinse it under water again and I just keep doing it until I get like all the white stuff off and hopefully I have yeah I said I got white stuff on there so we're gonna try to like get as much as that off as we can get so I just go like this rinse it under water Break. Rinse it under water. Break. Rinse it under water. Break. Now you just scrape it until like. Now that's what you don't want to do. You don't want to just use it and go like. I've seen that um, on YouTube and somebody was like, if you do it like that, you just like basically spreading the bacteria all over your tongue. So that's why I do like rinse it under water, spray, rinse it under water, spray until I feel like my tongue is clean enough. And they say a healthy tongue is pink. It shouldn't be white. Um... But, like, sometimes, honestly, you're not going to be able to get all of the white stuff off. Um, and that's okay, just as long as you do break your tongue. But I do, like, spit versus rinsing out my mouth with um, some water after I'm completely done. Because they say not to rinse out your mouth with water after you just finish brushing and doing the whole flossing and all that. Because if you rinse your mouth off with water, you basically basically just rinsing off everything you just did which is another reason why um they say like don't drink no water after you brush your teeth for like 30 minutes to an hour or something like that because it's the same thing um because you got to give like the toothpaste um some time to work and to sit on your teeth and to do what it needs to do and if you rinse it off then you just defeat the whole purpose of brushing your teeth to begin with so yeah that's pretty much um what i do for my oil hygiene routine so i use an electric toothbrush um and i use some floss and i use 
alcohol free mouthwash. This, this mouthwash is just the truth. It keeps your mouth fresh and clean all day. And then I just use toothpaste. The order of mine is I usually floss first. I may rinse my mouth up with um, mouthwash first, but usually it's floss, brush for two minutes, brush my tongue, and then that's it. Um, so yeah, uh, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Let me know, um, down in the comments if you like these type of videos. Let me know in the comments which order you, um, do your oil hygiene routine. Like, do you, do you floss first? Do you brush first? Um, just let me know in the comments what you do because I know everybody is different. I'm just sharing mine. Just keep in mind, this video is me sharing my oral hygiene routine before I actually get into dental hygiene school. So, it may not be 100% correct and don't go like 100% based off like what I'm saying because I'm not in school yet and I don't know everything. This is just what I do and it works for me. I will link the burst toothbrush down in the description box. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe and I'll see y'all in my next one.